From Daily Forex, this is Chris taking a look at the energy sector. This is WTI, and WTI crude oil has gone back and forth during the trading session, initially trying to rally, but then settled on, you know, basically unchanged. So looking at this candlestick, somewhat bearish, but we have a very supportive candlestick uh, the day before. I think we're just going to kind of go back and forth here. It's Thanksgiving week, so that probably has something to do with it. If we can break out above here, then I think we'll test 60, and I do think we eventually do that. 200-day EMA should offer support near $57, and if not, the 50-day uh, EMA below at 56 and a quarter or so uh, should offer. That gas broke down pretty significantly during the trading session. That's good, though, because now it's telling me that we're very likely going to go down here trying to form support off of this gap. So I think we have further to fall. There was a little micro gap there, but this big one here, I think, stands out a little too much. So we'll see. If we do roll back towards, you know, 240, 239, 238, that area down here, you know, we, we could still very much be in a upward uh, channel. This time of year, I don't sell under any circumstances. But the U.S. did drill far too much nat gas during the year. So I think we've got a little bit more work to do. Somewhere down in this area, I anticipate there will be a buying opportunity. The alternate scenario is that we turn around and go above 275. That'd be a buying opportunity as well. Uh, but I definitely prefer cheaper pricing. Mm -hmm.